Hey TikTok, Crypto Noob here with an XRP update. So this is the latest from James Finlan Law um, with his uh, timetable of actions for the SEC versus Ripple case. Um, basically ongoing now, we were looking for the 28th of September. Uh, this is the Ripple defendant's opposition. Um, and the official date of the 12th of November for the expert discovery deadlines. They're the main ones. But there's still several items outstanding at the moment. We've got the SEC motion to compel Ripple Slack communications, the Ripple motion to compel SEC designated privilege decision. Um, but that's not going to happen before the hearing on the 28th because Judge Netburn is going to review those documents in camera on the 28th. Um, and then you've got the SEC's motion to strike Ripple's fair notice defence. That's obviously a key one for Ripple. The fair notice defence is probably the easiest way that they can just outright win this case. And they've pretty much admitted in recent um, media that, you know, fair notice wasn't given. So that's going to be a very interesting consideration there for the judge. Um, and then there's also the individual defendant's motions to dismiss the SEC's first amended complaints. So obviously that's... Um, Brad Garlinghouse and, and, and co um, just basically have to deal with their own stuff as well. They've got their own motions in process. So we're not really going to see anything now, I don't think, before the end of the month, unless we have a surprise settlement. But there's a lot of talk at the moment as well with the SEC. Um, the settlement problem might not happen because, you know, XRP Ripple, they want to go for the win. They've got a very strong case. And if they win outright, then the SEC can't pursue anyone else because the fair notice defence would uh, set a precedent for the rest of crypto. So it's a very interesting few weeks. Um, is settlement likely? We just don't know. So, you know, I'll do my best to keep you posted. Give us a like, give us a follow, and I'll try and keep you up to date best I can.